my darling city, my only one, my hometown, a place second to none. It is me who is writing this. My name? Does it really matter who I am? What really matters is that I am your resident. An ordinary resident, one of many. Yet, I am the one you have to live without today. For the first time ever. I bet you're not missing me that much. For you're so diverse, multifaceted, gorgeous, wise, profound. You could hardly ever need someone like me, would you? With your fascinating streets and avenues, clean parks and comfortable boulevards, luxurious new facilities and charming heritage architecture, and the sea. This magic, unfathomable Caspian Sea with the mysterious old citadel encircled by the marvelous modern city. This is what makes you the one and only my city. A place venerated by generations of poets. What is my eulogy next to their verses? No words of praise will ever convey the message of your power and your fragility. Neither will I be able to tell this, nor you will ever need that indeed. Yet, today, you are without me. For the first time in decades, if not centuries. For the first time ever, you may heave a sigh of relief, for your streets are free from bustling traffic and urban smog. Your sidewalks rest from hasty steps. Your subway is free from endless crowds. Your cafes are resting from noxious visitors. Your luxury storefronts are no longer stared by avaricious customers. Your school courtyards hear no carefree laughter of kids, and your hidden nooks miss couples in love. So many things you're missing once left alone. This may be the finger of God, yet it is me who is missing you. The pictures from my childhood pop up in your memory Barefoot, I'm running through your cobbled streets. Time and again, I adore the aged walls of your old houses. With my eyes closed, I'm listening to the whisper of the autumn leaves. I sense the scents of your outdoor cafes, washed by rain. And then, when every inch of me is wet, I realize this was not rain at all. I am wet from my tears. My lovely city, please forgive me for littering, defacing and harming you. Always in haste, I hurt you so many times, never thinking of the suffering and pain I caused you, blaming you for something you had nothing to do with. So many times I dreamt of leaving you for good, running away from you. Run to where? Huh, somewhere. To a better and cooler place. And far away from you, all of a sudden, I started missing you so badly. And I felt so guilty indeed. Forgive me for not valuing you enough for the lack of love and passion to you. And now, I'm without you. This is what I have to live with. My darling city, 
Enjoy your well-deserved rest. A rest from me, the one who bothered you so much. And what about myself? I will have to leave on. Meanwhile, what is getting ever more clear to me each new day is that there is no way I can live without you anymore.